Hi, this is Sanjeev Sarkar at Hopping Chef, India's first luxury dining at home. Today, I am going to make a vegetarian maki sushi roll. Yes, you heard it right, a vegetarian maki sushi roll. Sushi is not only healthy, but very holistic food. You can have any time of the day. To start making sushi, you need Japanese variety of sushi rice, which is short, grain, starchy, but once cooked perfectly, gives a nice crunch to your sushi. Sushi vinegar, which is sweet and sour, gives a nice taste to your sushi rice. Nourish it because I am making maki sushi roll. Nourish it is a seaweed. Japanese horseradish called wasabi. Light soy for excellent flavor. Gari, which is sweet pickled ginger to cleanse your palate. You can choose any kind of filler you want. Today I am using asparagus, celery, pickled sweet mango also called chundo in India, assorted lettuce, some cream cheese. Let's make some sushi. You need a jug full of water to dip your knife and a bowl of water to dip your hand so that the rice doesn't stick to your hands while making sushi. I have already cooked some sushi rice to know more. Please click on to my earlier videos. Now I will be adding sushi vinegar which is 100 grams of sushi rice, cooked rice and 20 ml of sushi vinegar. Mix it lightly and add a little sushi vinegar into your hand dipping bowl so that the rice doesn't get stick while making sushi. Here is my nourish it. Always make sure you keep nourish it in a ziplock pouch to avoid being soggy. Dip your hand, both the hand, take handful of rice, gently press, spread it. Do not press too hard as the rice will break, it will lose the texture. Leave a space on top, you can remove any extra rice and work quickly onto it. A little wasabi, here goes my lettuce, asparagus, crisp celery, little bit of chundo to give a nice tangy taste and cream cheese. Time to roll. Roll it as tight as possible. Now our sushi is rolled. Let's cut it and plate it. Here I have a sharp sushi knife, dip it in water so that the sushi doesn't stick to your knife. And time to garnish. You can have any garnish of your choice. I am using some shredded carrots and spring onion and thinly sliced beetroot to add that color. Here comes the gari, which is the most important part of eating sushi. Little wasabi and soy sauce to go along. Voila, your sushi is ready. If you like our video, please subscribe to our channel.